back. Glad you're back, man. All right. Bushi, I don't know what happened last week, but Bushi has told me he's never beaten JT Dunks before. He hasn't. He said he's that never beaten JT now. Dunks before. Did he just say that? Uh, not like just now, but what, uh, mm. while he was on the line. Okay, then. Go! Get underway here. JT Dunks. Wait, does this tag lacklust? Is yeah. it lackluster? Is yeah, it Mario's not that good? I mean, I don't know if you read that much into it. Oh man, right back into it. It's so close, hits him with another up tilt. <laughs> so close. Uh, actually, it was uh, close enough to right. hit you. Miss. You might be a little misinformed by right. that. Up. Miss. Why is... So as you can see, Bushi's never beaten JT Dunks. <laughs> like, why is this matchup so so bad for Bushi? Like, why, why is this... Bushi's not betting against Mario. He doesn't have a Mario block. I think it's literally a it's JT, Dunks. JT Dunks block. He triggers me a little bit, too, in the way he plays. I, I, I find it very difficult to beat JT Dunks. I think there's just something about him. Is it just like a, he plays Mario differently, like a Joe Merrill's play Diddy kind of thing? Or? No, he's not exactly by the books. What One, he never air dodges, ever. So I try to go for an air dodge bait, and then he's like, nah, I'm just gonna hit you. Interesting. And two, um, I don't know what two is. But there's something about JT, oh, he's, he's got great air dodge baits himself, too, that I fall for all the time. That was very good awareness from Bushi there, canceling the second, uh, the, the kick of uh, the slide there and just going for the grab instead. Bushi's bringing it back a little bit though. Back throw is not going to kill because it's not going to even work. Bushi going for these grabs and up throw. Oh wow, see the that was that screen thing again. again. Yeah. Back throw will kill that time, however. I gotta ask him about his tag, Lacklust. He can fit ER in there. You can have 10 letters. Is it 10? I thought it was 8. L, A, no, it's 10. Lacklust is 8. Oh yeah, no, it is. He can fit Lackluster, he just chose not to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to ask him why. I'm gonna have to make an inquiry. I, I feel like it's, it's not that deep. You know, it is deep. JT Dunks is a deep guy. I don't know if you know him, but he's the deepest man you'll ever meet. You know, it is deep. The, the hole that Bushi dug himself in this game. Yeah, it's pretty deep hole. He has a jump, though. That's another thing. We I talked about Rickles being the god and then Leo being the god. JT Dunks is also pretty good at saving his jump. Dunks it up there. Is a confirmed. Sturm, get the waifus the off the screen. Thank you. It's Sailor Moon. No, it's just useless waifus. No, it's, it's hold up now. Wait, <laughs> hold up now. Wait a minute. <laughs> Hold on, but you remember who needs a waifu when you have a wafu? A wafu? A wafu, Waluigi. Wow. Wah. Dude, we, we both agree that Waluigi's the greatest. He's bae. Man, JT Dunks is really just kind of getting Bushi to work here. I mean, it may not look that unreachable for Bushi, and it's really not, but... But is this just... I don't know. Is this the matchup? I don't know why Bushi struggles so much with JT Dunks, but it's apparent he does. It's just the JT Dunks matchup. Oh, wow! There was some... I, I would call that actually my game. Just, just, and just that's a mix-up. And, and good to have you back, man. Oh, okay, okay. It's just ate right. through the fireball. And this is doable for Bushido. This is a smash pill. He's got rage. One bear will kill him off the side if he's got the... He was a little bit too aggressive there. A little bit too aggressive at the edge against back through Mario. That was tough. Let's see, B Bushi's still uh, very much defeated against JT Dunks. Going straight into it. No character counter picking, no character switching. Going back to Smashville. Three, two, one. Go! Alright, we're back. Hitting him with the bullets. Fireball gonna beat out the bullets, though. Sturm, we... you're the greatest. I love you. I had one fry. Two fries. I didn't eat them. So the winner of this will be going against JJ Rockets, and this is, uh, this is tournament game here for Bushi. It he is indeed. JT Dunk says two to lose at max. Whoa. Oh, that was so oh. smart there by Bushi. Did he jump? He didn't. He didn't. I'm actually, that was actually a very good DI there. Um, he very much could have died. DI standing there. 
And actually, not only did it all, killing off the top. There we go. Bushi coming back. Game two with a vengeance. Putting a little show on for us. Giving the up smash. All right, so JT Dunks, uh, the streak you got is might be the last time it happens. Might be the last time. Oh, he, he, he just died. I don't okay. know how he died, but he just died. There is some light at the end of this at the end of this tunnel for Bushi after never beating JT Dunks. Here we are moving into game three. Bushi having all the momentum. Now if you are JT Dunks, where are you taking him? Battlefield. SD. I just want to point out an upset that JT Dunks is wearing red night now. Normally he wears like a greenish hoodie and he's got his green hat because he plays green Mario. He always plays green characters. He's playing red and it's actually like really weird for me. I know, he's I actually did red. recognize him from the match. Yo, getting oh, the bullets, hey. 4%, but he doesn't care, he's got water. Water's important. It's essential to life. Hail hydrated. Did you just say hail hydrated? Yeah, hail hydrated. Hail hydrated? Yeah. <laughs> it's a very important thing. Alright, Battlefield is his counter pick. JT Dunks does very much enjoy this stage. Bushi likes it a little bit too. You saw him getting a little bit of combos there earlier. Bushi likes the stage for the sheer fact that Bayonetta can recover. It's one of the only characters. Uh, it, it's, it's like I can count the, the list on my hand, the number of characters that can recover from this low. From like the, the bottom left corner of the stage. Um, having like that kind of three jump glitch I think, that she has. I also think Battlefield, Battlefield has a. Battlefield, Battlefield has a kind of lower floor than most right. stages. I know Dreamland has a really low floor. Battlefield might be the second lowest. Right, and Bushi likes to just because of this blast zone, he can recover way down low, like I said. Uh, Mario, if he was that low, even with the jump, would be able to do it. Um, yeah. Oh. Whoa, there. Wait, did he just run off the platform? Was that a run off platform read? Uh, or did he roll? I missed it. He air dodged. Yeah, no, he air dodged. He air dodged. Yeah. Okay. But Bushi looking to... Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. The right. standard JT Dunk I've special. I've said this once, and I've said this twice, and I've said this a million times. I'll say it again. Don't try to edge guard JT Dunks, because then you'll get fair spiked and die. Doesn't matter if he's Captain Falcon or Donkey Kong. Any character that has a spike, don't do it, you'll die. Oh man, that was absolutely filthy. Proven it there that the JT Dunks is still alive and well. You never edge guard this man. Yeah, he just, he just spike you. Bushi trying to go for that slide and an up smash again. Uh, which actually like is a thing. Slide at the edge, the down smash is also a thing. Uh, so you can kill very, very early. Oh, uh, let's see how much mileage Bushi gets over this. Was Whoa. that was that not a full witch time? It was not, not at all. Uh, when did he, he use just, it? He just used Bat Within a little bit ago. Oh, Bat Within stales witch time too? Uh, or weakens yeah. witch time too? Yeah, every, every time you use the move, like, you know, I believe you don't even have to hit anything, right? So if, if you air dodge and Bat Within something, that weakens witch time. I don't know, we'll have to double check that. Sturm's trying to say something. And I'm pretty sure he's right about whatever he's saying, but I can't hear what that means on it. Sturm's usually right, he's a smart guy. So Is he dead? Low he here. might be dead, he's dead. He's very much dead. Bushi breaks the curse. I would consider this an upset. Even though PR-wise it's not, I would consider this an upset. Yeah, you could, did he, you, you could see him, he's a little... He's happy now, because this is his first win over JT Dunks. This is absolutely, it, it's an upset. This goes into the upset thread. So now we're going to have, what up? Do you want out or should I go top out? I don't care. Do you want to commentate? Yeah, kind of. All right, well, I'll, I'll tap out. Okay. I'll see you guys later. Ruins out again. I always love commentating with him. It's good to, it's good to have him back.